This is the super-powered competition field. There are 15 missions which can be done in any order. You do not have to complete all the missions, just try as many as you can in each two and a half minute robot match. Only the robot game score from your best match will be counted. There are two launch areas and two home areas. You may have up to two technicians at each launch area. Your robot must start completely inside either launch area and you should program it to return to either home area. You can handle and modify your robot between runs while it is in either home area. Gracious professionalism is how we express our core values in First Lego League. The robot game is an important place to observe gracious professionalism and the referees will evaluate this for each team at each robot match. Your robot and all your equipment must fit into two launch areas and under a height limit of 12 inches. If it is small enough to fit in just one launch area and under this height limit, then you will score the bonus points. Mission 1. Innovation Project Model In this mission, you will use the innovation project model you have made that represents the solution to your innovation project. If your innovation project model is at least partly in the hydrogen plant target area. Mission 2. Oil Platform Pump the oil so that the fuel units load into the fuel truck. Then deliver the fuel truck to the fueling station. If a fuel unit is in the fuel truck, Bonus! If there is at least one fuel unit in the fuel truck and the fuel truck is at least partly over the fueling station target. Mission 3. Energy Storage Load energy units into the energy storage bin and then release the stored energy unit from the tray under the model. If there is an energy unit completely in the energy storage bin, maximum of three. If the energy unit is completely removed from the energy storage tray. Mission four, solar farm. Start the distribution of the energy units by moving them off their positions on the mat. If an energy unit has been completely removed from its starting circle. Bonus! If all three energy units have been completely removed from their starting circles. Mission 5. Smart Grid Raise your field's orange connector to complete the smart grid connection with the opposite field. If your field's orange connector is completely raised. Bonus! If both teams' orange connectors are completely raised. This is the guided mission. Teams will be provided with the program to complete the first part of the mission. Mission 6. Hybrid Car Recharge the hybrid car by inserting the hybrid unit into the car. If the hybrid car is no longer touching the ramp. If the hybrid unit is in the hybrid car. Mission 7. Wind Turbine Release the energy units from the wind turbine. If an energy unit is no longer touching the wind turbine. Mission 8. Watch television. 
Raise the television screen and move the energy unit to the television slot. If the television is completely raised, if there is an energy unit completely in the green television slot. Mission 9. Dinosaur Toy Insert an energy unit or a rechargeable battery into the dinosaur toy to make it work. If the dinosaur toy is completely in the left home area, if the dinosaur toy lid is completely closed and there is an energy unit inside. Or there is a rechargeable battery inside. Mission 10. Power Plant. Release the three energy units from the power plant. If an energy unit is no longer touching the power plant. Bonus, if all three energy units are no longer touching the power plant. Mission 11, Hydroelectric Dam. Send the water unit from the top of the hydroelectric dam into the turbine wheel to release the energy unit. If the energy unit is no longer touching the hydroelectric dam. Mission 12, Water Reservoir. Place the looped water units from the river above and below the dam into the water reservoir or onto the red hooks. If a looped water unit is completely in the water reservoir touching the mat, If a looped water unit is placed on a single red hook. Mission 13, Power to X. Deliver energy units to the hydrogen plant target area. If there is an energy unit completely in the hydrogen plant target area. Maximum of three. Mission 14, Toy Factory. Deliver energy units to the toy factory bin and release the mini dinosaur toy. If there is an energy unit at least partly in the slot in the back of the toy factory or in the red hopper, maximum of three. If the mini dinosaur toy has been released, Mission 15, Rechargeable Battery. Deliver energy units to the rechargeable battery target area. If there is an energy unit completely in the rechargeable battery target area, maximum of three. Precision Tokens. The less you interrupt your robot outside home, the more points you will keep. If you interrupt your robot outside the home areas, you will lose a precision token. Precision tokens left on the field will result in extra points. Remember that referees will be evaluating your gracious professionalism at each match. Remember to read the Robot Game Rulebook and check for any updates during the season. Good luck!